Hi, I'm Paisley. I just wanted to say welcome back to our channel. I hope you enjoy this vlog of me getting a haircut and my mom cleaning and doing a little lemon haul. Um, she's sorry she deleted the intro clip, so this is just me introing the vlog. And the next clip will be my mom getting ready for Pilates class this that morning. So I hope you guys enjoy. So I'm wearing this top from Aritzia. I have it in black and I really like it. It's so comfortable. I get a size medium. It's the Butter Vibe tank and this is in the Poetic Pink color and it was on sale. Um, and then I'm just wearing, I'm gonna wear black Align shorts. These are actually with pockets. I realized I grabbed that. I didn't wanna grab one without pockets. And then it's a little chilly this morning so I'm just gonna wear my black full zip scuba hoodie from Lulu. Okay, so here is my outfit. These tanks are so comfortable. I like sizing up to a medium because the small was just a little tight around the chest. Um, so it's a little bit looser around my waist, but I don't mind that at all. It just makes it really comfortable. And this poetic pink is just so pretty. Um, and I've just been really obsessed with Align shorts lately. Uh, it's probably just because it's the summer, but I haven't been grabbing my leggings as much. Um, yeah, so this is the outfit. Like I said, we were at a wedding last night, so my brother is actually watching Paisley, so it was really sad waking up without her this morning. So after the gym, we're gonna go pick up Paisley because she's like 10 minutes on the road. Luckily, our family's really close. Um, and then we're just going to like clean today because we need to just take time to like actually clean the house. It is due. And then we're gonna go to five o'clock mass tonight and then out to dinner. So yeah, I just figured I would kind of vlog the weekend but that is what is on the agenda for today so yeah now we have about 13 minutes until plotty starts so we have to go <laughs> all right we're done at the gym so time to pick up the baby girl let's see her hi did you miss us? Hi! Where are you going? You're getting your toy? Is that your toy? So cute! Hi! Okay, so we are back home. I'm starving. Um, all I have to really eat right now is like random things, but I did make chia pudding before I left. So in here I just have chia pudding, raspberries, and banana. So I'm gonna eat that. And then we're gonna bathe Paisley. So she's gonna be a wet dog today, but she really needs to be bathed. And like I said, we just are gonna like clean, like Matt's gonna run some errands today. And then later we have church and dinner. So yeah, I'm gonna eat this and shower and I'll catch up with you guys after. All right, good girl, you got her bath. <laughs> you want a treat? Yeah, that's a good girl. Yeah. Good girl. You need to shake it out. No, just, we'll just keep doing this for like an hour. <laughs> Oh, you're so cute. <laughs> okay, so sometime, sometimes I decide to cut her hair when she, after her shower because it's easier to find mats. And actually now that we're out to have a yard, I like doing it outside, like how good she is. So I'm cutting some of her hair. So I figured I would film some of it to show you how good of a girl she is. And also it's nice and sunny, so it probably feels nice and warm, right? Because you're getting usually really cold after a bath. No, it's probably nice and warm. You're getting nice and dry. You're such a good girly. You're a good girl. You're gonna stand up. Good girly.
All right, let's see it, baby girl. Shake it out. Come on, give me a shake. Come on. Are you done? Come on. You're good. Come on, one treat. Yeah, that was a good kitty. Shake it. Shake it out. Give me a shake. I need a shake. Come on. Good girl day. Okay, so the fl floors are all vacuumed and actually it just started absolutely pouring outside. We didn't cover the patio furniture in time, so we thought it'd just be like drizzle, but it actually was like puddles right now. So that was actually really good timing that I was able to get Paisley a haircut. And now it's just kind of like cozy in here. And um, I want to show you the blinds. So I remember when I first vlogged our tour here, I had like an appointment with the lady who does the blinds. So she's like a family friend. And yeah, she just like, you know, helps you pick out blinds. So I'm so happy with them. We just did like flat shades. This is like a matte pearl color, I believe. And then we just did like a white pulley thing here. And it was one less than what blackout was. So it's still like, light really does still come through, but I didn't want like total blackout. So just one down and it's perfect. I really, really like them. So we got it in here and also the office, but yeah. I was gonna surf for the floors, but I don't know, I might wait till tomorrow because like when since it's raining, we're like tracking water in. So I don't know. I'm going to clean the mirrors next because like you could I don't know if you could tell in here, but the the mirrors are pretty dirty. So I'm gonna clean the mirrors and then after that I'm going to wipe down the countertops here and in the kitchen. Okay, so I finished cleaning. I did my hair and makeup to get ready to go out tonight. But Matt's out running some errands and I figured I would do a little Lululemon haul. I haven't done one in a while. I haven't been buying too much like workout clothes because I've actually been buying a lot of like work clothes. But I have been really gravitating, gravitating towards wearing like the same type of outfit at the gym. Which is why I think I might do a declutter athletic wear video tomorrow. Because um, I find myself really wearing just like aligned shorts and like an aligned tank or just like a basic t-shirt. I haven't really been wearing just like full on like sports bras to the gym like I used to in the past. I think just cause my body's changed, I'm getting older. I just like don't feel like just wearing a sports bra. So I'm just like kind of changing my style a little bit, I feel like. So yeah, I got a lot of like the same stuff, but different colors. Okay, so I got the Align shorts and I get the six inch in a size four. So I got a second pair of black shorts since I've been wearing them a lot. I've only had one pair all these years. So I finally got a second pair. And then I also got it in the poolside color and also the graphite gray, which I haven't tried on yet. Um, and then also I've been liking these tops. It's like the cotton, like the cotton top. Let's see what it's called. Right here, the classic fit cotton blend top, a size six. So I got the short sleeve in a black and then I got the tank in a black and also the strawberry milkshake. I just feel like that would look really cute with just like black shorts and then like a black sports bra and then just like throwing this as a pop of color. Um, and then I got the Ebb to Street bra. I actually got it in black too to like make a nice outfit. And then I also got it in the poolside color. I was between getting this or the Align tank. So I'm not sure, I might get the Align tank instead for an outfit, but I just thought maybe that'd be too much poolside all at once. So maybe just like break it up with like a top over it. I don't know, we'll try it on. And then I am yet to try the um the high neck align tank so the align tank i've been sizing up to an eight but i don't think for this i would need to size up so i got a six uh just because like your boobs aren't out so i really hope this isn't too tight so let's see what that's like um yeah so let's try this on okay so here are just the basic black align shorts the six inch and then i'm wearing the to street bra or the flow wide bra i don't like saying to street the flow wide bra in a size six and then this is just the t-shirt the cotton blend t-shirt in a size six i definitely like the six i didn't even try the four because i feel like the sleeves would be or the shoulders would be too tight and yeah it just like covers you it's not too long not too short um and then if like you wanted to tuck the front end into your sports bra or even like the back you know you can do that too it's just like you know something really easy to throw on if you want to be covered but like not have it be like too long like an all yours see now here is the tank top version i kind of did want a tank top that like showed the sports bra but this actually fully covers you which i'm fine with because i still really like 
the fit, it's like, you know, the same thing. A size six again is perfect. Um, I feel like if I went smaller, it'd be like probably too tight around the chest or something. And, you know, I don't want to feel like tight and constricted. So yes, yeah, so it is like perfect. Just, you know, you feel like really good going into the gym, nice and covered. And yeah. Okay, now here is the strawberry pink. I really love this color. I have a few items in this color. And you can like definitely see the black sports bra underneath, which I think is fine. It's like, you could tell you're wearing just like a cute black set. And then this is just like, you know, you throw it on. Again, you can just like, if you're feeling yourself, you want to show your stomach a little bit, you can tuck it under. Um, I don't make it like too perfect or anything. And I just love the way it hits back here too. It's like the perfect length. Um, so yeah, I really like these tanks. Okay, now here is the poolside color, which is so pretty. I don't really have, I don't have anything in this color yet. Um, so the shorts are so soft. I'm so happy they didn't make these double lined. If you know, they've been making a lot of the aligns double lined, which I hate so much, but this one isn't. Um, I'm a little iffy if I need to keep the top or not. Like I said, I haven't been wearing just sports wears to the gym anyways. So I probably would end up covering it with a shirt. So maybe I should just get the align take instead because I actually really do like this color. So I think it would look pretty cool as like a whole set. And obviously you can mix and match like the tanks and stuff. Um, so I'm sure like the align tank in this color would probably look good with the gray shorts or the black. I don't know, I have to see what else I have. But um, yeah, definitely keeping the shorts. Maybe I'll exchange this for the align tank. But such a pretty color. Okay, well, I love the way this looks so much. I think this top is so flattering. Um, I think a six is good. I mean, it's definitely, like, tight, but, like, tight where it's a supportive sports bra, and I kind of like the way it's, like, tighter around here because then it kind of, like, snatches you in and, like, up. Um, and I don't feel like it's... Like, I don't think it's too tight around my back. Like, right here, that's, like, what I would be worried about. It's definitely snug, so, like... I feel like I could do maybe a size eight, but right now size six is flattering. So even like the line tank, I wear a six and an eight, depending on if I'm feeling good that day, I want to be like snatched and like flattered, or if it's like that time of the month that I want it like looser, you know, just like then I go to the eight. So it really just depends. I love the way this looks and the graphite gray, I'm definitely going to keep. So like I said, all I've been wearing are align shorts lately and this will go with so many colors. Like this would look so cute. I have like pink aligned tanks, or obviously even just strawberry milkshake, black, you know, gray goes with a lot. So that is my little Lululemon haul. All right, now I need to pick out what I'm gonna wear tonight. Um, I need something that's like appropriate for church, but also like really cute to go out, to go out on a dinner date. So I need to find a good in-between. Okay, so I think this is gonna be the outfit of the night going to mass. I hope it's okay, it's like a crop top kind of, but like I can always, you know, cover it up. All from Maritzia, these are the Anthem shorts in a size six, freeform shirt in a size small, and this is one of like their Babaton sculpt knit tops in a size small. Um, and this is the light birch color. And yeah, and then I'm just wearing these heels from Steve Madden. Their wedges are so comfortable. They're like the Irene heels or something like that. Let's see if I can find a link for that. Um, but yeah, Matt sounds like he's getting home from errands right now. So once he's ready, we're gonna head to the mass. Hi, cute girl. <laughs> Look like you're in jail. Okay, so here is the fit. Um, also, we're looking to go out to dinner at this restaurant that um, in a nearby town we haven't been to. It's like rather new, but we couldn't get reservations. So after mass, we're gonna try to walk in and see if they have walk-ins or at least something at the bar because we actually do like sitting at the bar. So hopefully we can get in there because we've been meaning to try it and just have heard really good things about it. Okay, we just finished mass and now we're driving to the restaurant. And I don't think I actually mentioned on here that um, usually his dad goes to mass or 5 p.m. mass on Saturdays. So we surprised him. And I wish I got it on camera because he was like genuinely, he was like uh, genuinely surprised. But it happened like really quickly because we just so happened to pull up right behind him when we arrived at church. Um, so it happened really fast. But yeah, that was nice. So they're not coming to dinner with us though because we wanted to like do our own thing for dinner. So let's hope the restaurant has seating for us. Also, I need to mention that Matt and I are matching unintentionally. <laughs> 
Alright, so we're able to walk into the place that we wanted to. This is the name of it. It's like a nice Italian place, so we're in the bar area. I ordered a Bada Bang, which is a vodka drink, and he ordered an old fashioned. Old fashioned special. Cheers. Alright, and before we order and take some anyway, I'm gonna get the Tagliatelle gluten free. And what are you getting? So did anybody get a special? Did anybody get the uh, cashew peppy? Yeah, it looks so good. Like, here in here it's like grilled swordfish, steak, rancino, the chicken all sounds so good. Alright, so our drinks were so good. We ordered wine with dinner and we actually both ended up getting the same dish. Thank you. Thank you so much. It was very well. Shit, it smells so good. I got the gluten free version. His is not gluten free, but they look identical. This looks actually amazing. Uh, cheers. <laughs> I had to get dessert because they had like gluten free, flourless chocolate cake with a gelato. And then I got blueberry gelato with shortbread crumble, which looks so good. Okay, we just finished dinner. <laughs> And um, now we're actually driving to his parents' house and we're just gonna chill there for a second before going home. But I told Matt that was like the best gluten-free pasta I think I've had in America. Cause I've had really good ones in Italy and London as he pointed out. But the way that pasta was made, it was just like al dente and just, it was so good. I never, it was like just really unique too. Um, and the dish itself was really good. The like, what's the? Um, Carbonara. No, the uh, bacon. Uh, pancetta. Pancetta, yeah, that's so good. Um, so yeah, now we're just going to his parents, gonna hang out for a bit before going home to see Peasley. Right, we're driving home right now, but look how pretty the sky is. That's one thing that's been so nice. Let me turn off the blinkers. Living at the suburbs, like, oh my God, the skies have been so pretty. I mean, obviously it's just cause it's summer, but I'm just obsessed. All right, where's my cute girl? <gasps> there you are. You got your rawhide or whatever that is. <gasps> hi. Oh, hi. I missed you so much. Aw. Yeah, you got a fresh cut and a fresh bath. Cute girl. <laughs> You're so cute. Hey. <laughs> Don't fall. Oh my god. <laughs> You're crazy. <laughs> Cute girl, you ready to go outside and then go to bed? Yeah. Okay, so it is like nine o'clock now, so we are going to take her out and then get ready for bed. And that is it, so I'm gonna end the vlog here. I'll probably actually vlog tomorrow too, since tomorrow's Sunday, and I'll just be doing like pretty much similar stuff to what I did today. So I'm gonna end the vlog here, and that is it. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.